Alrighty, round three. The classic skull clamp, no creature's hand. Okay, mountain. Mountain, mountain, mountain. Let's start with skull clamp. Brainstorm here is kind of a waste since we um, have demo a shuffle effect already and a better shuffle effect. I think we'll just ramp. Uh, could demonic tutor for like bitter blossom. Ooh, that's a good target to shackles. To shackle on up. I think I'll start with brainstorm. Beautiful, beautiful. Beautiful. Uh, disfigure. Disfigure is not good right now, but it should be good against this color, these colors in this start, basically. Maybe just get rid of Jace and a land. I don't even have to shuffle if I want to redraw Jace. Let's get the watery grave. And just shuffle away the Jace. We have enough card draw that we don't need a slower version. And shackles should be good. What uh, what other demonic tutor targets do we have? Damnation. Um, Karn even. Avalanche riders. All right, so we can. We're still capable of stealing Brimass. Let's start with ancestral. Soul Ring is good. So I can... Shackle Skull Clamp it? Will I... Will I keep it? <laughs> if I Skull Clamp it? Gain control of target creature with power less than or equal to the number of shackles you, or island <laughs> shackles you control islands you control for as long as shackles remains tapped. So I think I should keep it, even when I equip up skull clamp. Um, I'm somewhat nervous though that I won't, so I'll just keep up this figure <laughs> instead. I need a, I need to either Google it or call a judge. Skull clamp is actually nice with shackles since it actually draws you the cards even if it changes control back to them. <laughs> Alright, disfigure, good disfigure target. No thank you. And Spellskite 
should be good. We can even leave up Cryptic and start attacking with Brimaz. That's fine. Um, I could disfigure it and redirect the magma jet. Actually, nice since we can just skull clamp up the cat. Put a card on top. And now we want it on the skull clamp since. We could uh, end up redirecting something. Elspeth. Not really the hugest of deals. We can even redirect the uh, plus ability. Keep that tapped. And I can Karn. Kill the Elspeth. Spellscape, and this board is looking fantastic. Not sure what we lose to at this point. I don't think that's it. Still no reason to untap. I can just uh, minus on the sword. We already have all our good cards. <laughs> There's the downside to Demonic Tutor. We already have all our good cards and an engine to draw everything. attack. Uh, we can, I was going to say, we can bounce the token after it blocks with cryptic. Alright, let's Just 
mess with our opponent's mana as much as possible, make them equip up the soldier, then we can bounce the soldier. Still have Karn and Jace against two cards. Don't want our shackles to die. Uh, I don't think we want the white, even though it would be fine. Just because it's rough on our mana base. Wasteland didn't look very good. Um, most of our options aren't very good in the sideboard. But our main deck looks fairly tight already. Yeah, I think we're favored enough that we just want to play our solid car, our our good cards, and not get mana screwed. We do have some awkward things though, and we're not perfectly suited against aggro decks, but we should be good enough. Like Braid, Spoke Stack, no, Putrid Imp, no, Forge Master, no. So we'll just keep it the same. See if we can't do what we did again. Yeah, like damnation is gonna be huge. So we'll just keep this. And Strix is also an excellent draw. Uh oh. Opponent has their own unfair cards. That sword is a huge problem. Let's see, let's draw. Drawing was more important at this point than bitter blossoming because they can't chump a sort of feast and famine. Okay. Ooh, Ashiok. It's not the worst draw. Since it isn't immediately killable. Ooh, and Phyrexian Revoker is perfect to find. Since we can name sort of feast and famine after we damnation. And it's going to be awkward for the opponent to just, like, attack Ashiok. <laughs> so if nothing ridiculous happens, like, that is perfect for us. That's what we want to see. We want to see another creature that just dies to damnation uneventfully. Alright. Attacking Ashiok. I suppose we stick to the plan. Alright. So now if our opponent can't equip up sword, we can Revoke it. This would be a lot better if I could cast Cryptic Command right now, but... Char. Okay. Just need blue sources. And those are blue sources.
Alright, Jace is perfect here. Since we can bounce creatures for days. Oh my god, this mana crypt is doing work. How many flips have we won? So our opponent won't be able to pay and equip, pay echo and equip. So it's a question of do we want Maluku to just kill our opponent? Yeah, let's let's just do that. Man a grip doing so much work and char. Ah, uh, won the flip. Lost the flip. Lost the flip. I wasn't even paying attention to the flips. Alright, well, Maluku gets the job done. Yeah. <laughs> that was a funny game.